Hey guys, it's Raleigh Game DHT here to bring you second episode of my Inter Milan career mode. Um, last episode we were just sorting things out, getting some transfers, fixing up the team, seeing the formations we could use, that stuff. And in this episode we're going to play the first game of the Serie A. This is the team that we've gone with. I've only bought Salvio. Except from that, uh, the team's exactly the same. But... Um, I was thinking of getting a centre back because I don't really like Vidic that much, but um, I'd have to think about it. I, I can't. There's a couple of players I got in mind, but I don't know at the moment. All right, so I'm gonna try look for some. Um, oh crap, nice Bruce. So I'm gonna try look for some centre backs. I'm gonna go for Zuma. Let's see how much they would want for him. They'll probably want quite a lot for him to be honest. Quite about him. Um, Marquinhos as well. Let's go for Marquinhos. I know Pierre is just gonna bump it and probably say like thirty million or something. And then there was another guy that someone commented in my video said I should get some guy called Scar Scar. I don't know how to say his name. Some guy said to get him as well. And have a look at Natasic as well. I think that's how you say his name because he's quite good as well. No, let's see. Um, I have no clue where he comes from. And I clicked that again. Cent where is position? Where there oh there it is. Centre back. Uh there he is. Twenty one years old. I thought he was I thought he was like nineteen or twenty. So we'll inquire about him, see how much they would ask. Alright, so let's see how much they would want for these. So whoa. Who's the cheapest? Natasha Natasha is the cheapest, but I don't know if I really like I don't know if I really want him. Marquina is probably the probably the best one out of these three, but too expensive. I'll, prob I'll probably just set it with Zuma. Zuma's quite good as well. Alright, let's try sending 5 million full thing. Because um, the price that they asked for, some guy covered in my video said the price that they asked for is not the price that you should actually send them. You should always send them cheaper than that, which I didn't know. But uh, let's start our first game of the season. We're against Torino away. Um, yeah, we'll use this team. Stick with the same formation, yeah. Why is he so open, man? Go to him. Oh my god, he just got through. He's scoring this. Oh, what a bad shot. Nosherino. Beautiful. It's one, two plays. Bang. One, two. Go again. Who is that? Oh no, who was that? How did I not score that? Icardi. No way. Beautiful play as well. Why is his space always open? Why is he not marking the guy? Oh my, what a pass. Oh, if he scored that. My god. Go on, run, Icardi. I see you run, Osvaldo. Wait. There we go. Oh, Osvaldo, you've got this. Come back. Oh, go on. Finish that beautiful. Oh, no. Uh, that should have went in. Osvaldo. Don't want to do anything. They're probably going to give away a penalty knowing this game. Oh, my god. How did I just let him go through there? Oh, my god, no. Oh, my god. Oh, we got lucky there. Nice pass. Go on, make that run, Osvaldo. Someone overlap it. Icardi, I see the overlap. Icardi. Icardi, Icardi, Icardi. Finish that, Icardi. Yes! 1 0, Icardi. We'll win it that 89th minute. Yes, man. Right at the end. We all literally get dominated this game, to be honest. Ah, oh, see, it's all about being clinical this game. If you're clinical, you'll win games. Oh, my God. Oh, don't do this to me. Do not do this to me. Do not do this to me. I just scored and he scored straight after, man. Oh, my God. My defending was so poor. Icardi, I see your overlap again. Please, Icardi. Go on, cut back. Yes. Finish that. Yes. 2-1, Icardi. Two goals in two minutes. 89th minute and 90th minute. That's what I'm talking about. Oh my god, I surely thought with that, them equalising, that was it. <laughs> yes. Last minute goal. Ricardi, two goals in the Serie A now. Check the stats. Um, look at that. They've had 11 shots, 4 on target, and he had 63% possession. I had 6 shots, 3 on target, and 37% possession. That is disgraceful. I literally got dominated, but... I was like I said, it's just all about being clinical, and it's also transfer deadline day. Let's see if we can try get a centre back because I want to get rid of Vidic, man. He's too slow. See, see, unacceptable. Chelsea accepted. See how much. Uh, I didn't even send an offer for my queen. I thought I did. 
I might as well just, I might as well just go for Zuma. Um, squad rotation should be fine. That's, that's fair enough. You know what? Let's send an offer for Marquinhos as well. Just to see. Did it accept it? Do I don't even have that much money. Do 13 mil. Uh, probably won't accept it. They're probably going to ask for like 18 or 19 mil. Natasic. I don't know if I really want him. I'll send in an offer, but I don't know if I really want him. Right, let's see if they accept it. See how much they want. Is it? Ah, uh, see. I knew they would ask for that much for Marquinhos. Uh, I don't have that much though. Uh, let's see who could I put in part of the deal. Um, you know, Kuzmanovic. Yeah, where is that guy? Yeah, Kuzmanovic. So shit. I d I'm never gonna use him. Uh, just carry on. See if they accept. Duh, duh. Still didn't accept. I oh, forget my queen. I'm not even gonna go for him anymore. They just want too much. I'll just I'll just settle with Zuma. To be honest, I'm happy with Zuma. Prefer Zuma than Natasic. He's younger, and I've used him with Week 14, and I know he turns into an absolute tank. So let's just wait till this transfer deadline day ends. I, I don't need to get anyone else. I'm sorted of the team now. Where's get rid of Vidic? Where's Zuma? There he is. I'm pretty happy with my team now, to be honest. Maybe uh, maybe tra next transfer window, maybe get a world-class striker. And then that's pretty much it. And then maybe in the future get a, a left mid as well. Get rid of Dodo. He's, he's nothing. He's nothing special to be honest. But for now, I'm pretty happy with this team. Let's carry on with the transfer deadline day. Do thinking. I might sell Kuzmanovic because I don't even I don't even flipping want the guy. There's some players that in the team which I literally do not want. Like Kuzmanovic. Um anyone else. Let's see. I think I think he's just him to be honest. Look at the player that I got on loan. Bottom looks out. Longo. I wonder if Longo's good. Alvarez, forgot about Alvarez. Should I call him back? Now I'll leave him where he is. Um, that's it, really. Just because Zmanovic don't really want. Just carry on with the transfer deadline. Like Hopefully, someone tries to take him off me because I literally do not want that guy. <laughs> 73 million total spent so far. Two transfers off of Ranocchio. Get out of here. My cat did. I think I'm going to give him. And Hernanez. Oh. Oh, why didn't you? Ah, oh, should I sell him? If this in his offer before, I probably would have sold him. We probably got someone like Verratti or something. Why did he send in this offer so late? If they sent it like a couple days ago, I would have most likely done it. Oh, no, but if, if I don't. I won't have enough time to get another midfielder if I do it now. Crap. Oh, I don't know if I should sell him or not. Oh. Tough decisions. Uh, I'll just. Nah, I can't sell him. I don't have any other midfielders to sell him. All I've got is Guarine. You just say he gets injured. I'll literally have no backup strikers left. Me midfielders. All I'm hoping is someone buys Kuzmanovic of me, gets some money off him. I don't think anyone's going to buy him. Someone would have sent an offer by now. If someone sends an offer now, it's too late anyway. Yeah, and that's it. That's it with my transfers. No one left. That's it. Sarah transfer day like day has ended. We've only, we only signed two players this transfer window, Zuma and Salvio. Both good players, both have good potential, so I'm quite happy with that. Let's go up to our next game. Who do we have next? Hurry up with this simulation. Takes forever. Check who we got Sassuolo next. So I'm going to end the video here, and next episode we will be playing Sassuolo. If you enjoyed this video, then make sure to smash that like button. Subscribe if you're new to my channel and peace guys.